Hey guys, uh, welcome back to the second episode of Let's Build a uh, Space Station. On today's episode, I plan to make a uh, module of the uh, space station that powers the whole thing. So it's going to be full of battery bags, full of solar panels, full of stuff that generates power for the whole thing. So in the event that I do run out of power, I do have some sort of way of making power again without needing power if that makes sense because you can't extend solar panels without power. So from last episode I do remember I did have four sets of solar panels on the uh, bit of the space station that's up there now and I forgot to extend them so let's go extend them now. I do know I had a uh, action group for it but I think forget what it was I think it was one and two we'll find out now yep the action group was one and I should be generating power that's good that is good now I just realized these solar panels here could be a bit of an issue later on when I'm trying to dock with it but we'll see how much power I'm generating enough to keep my tanks full which I'm happy about Alright, so let's head back to the Space Center and into the Vehicle Assembly Building and let's work out how to build a module for... I um, can't think today... I, um, the module I want to do, the solar panel power module. I do know I want it to be a vessel that's still uh, unmanned, so with one of these hooked up to the remote remote guidance units. So I'll put that up there. That's my centerpiece. And I want this one to look half decent, so I'm gonna stick that there, and where's the clampatron? This one. that does not make any sense whatsoever because I want it to have somewhat of a pointy-ish nose if that makes sense at all uh, da, 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 da. I'm still getting used to the uh, menus up here so hang on, what up if I add a fuselage there we go that will do there so I'll be back in a bit when I work out the design Okay, so I've done a bit of designing and testing, and this is what I came up with. Basically, all batteries along the middle here, and eight solar panels all the way up to the top. So that should be provided. That should be that should provide enough power for the whole space station and to last quite a while because there's a lot of batteries, and there's already quite a few batteries on the space station as it is. Now I'm going to design the propulsion system. So as always, I'm going to have the little tank on the bottom with the little thruster on the bottom here as well. And a stack decoupler, which I keep forgetting which are where. I think they're in here, yeah? Yep. That one. Okay. Now I'm going to go with that asparagus st staging again. So I need the adapter, which is that one. No, that's wrong. One. It's this one. Yep, and that big fuel tank. I want to somehow incorporate these into it one time. That'd be cool. But for now, I'm just going to go with what I know works. So I'll be back once I've uh, designed all this. Alright, so I've done the uh, design on how I want it to look, not how to look, how it to function, and I've done asparagus staging again with seven rockets, each rocket having a total of 15,000 thrust, so times that by seven and that's 10,500 thrust. That's a lot. And I've also done the staging. Something's gone wrong right there, I noticed. So that's got to go down here. And that one's got to go there. Now let's double check this staging before I go because something's changed. So, alright. These two here should go first. 
Yep, one, two, three, four. Perfect. Then all that drops off and then that rocket goes. All right. Save, launch. And I haven't tested launching altogether. Let's try this. All right, so let's throttle up. Go. Oh wow, well. SAS RCS forgot, forgot, forgot. Oh dear, oh, oh dear. <laughs> oh, um, um, <laughs> I need to fix that. A bit of an issue there. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um, how to fix that? How to fix that? Oh dear. This is not going to go well. Let's just end all the stagings. Oh damn. Well, let's return to the vehicle assembly lab and try and fix that. Because the issue was, is these are just bending like crazy. Why? How? How to fix it? I'm thinking struts. Can I strut there to there? This is going to be a long process. Let's try this. Oh, so hang on. Control Z that. Oh, wow. Well, yep, there we go. Let's do that from there to all the way up here. No, need to do the whole time six thing. Hang on. Alright. So let's do the six times. Whack that on. All the way up to here. Alright. Let's launch again. Let's hope that fixes it. Oh wow. That was quite funny, wasn't it? Okay. Launch, SAS on, RCS on, go. Okay, that's fixed it. Good, good, good. Alright, so as usual, when I hit the, what was it, uh, 1,000, no, 10,000 meter mark, I'm going to bend over a little bit, and go again. I'm overheating, there's one stage done too. Jeez, that stage went fast. Anyway, so when I hit 10,000 meters, I'll, um, what is it, go to the right a little bit? No, yeah, right a little bit. Why am I spinning again? Anyway, so I'll be back when I hit the 10,000 meter mark. Just past the 10,000 meter mark, now I've got to uh, somehow push that over while I'm spinning, which is going to be fun. Alright, that's enough actually, that's too much. That's too much. Alright, and when I hit the 30,000 meter mark, I'm going to uh, bend right over, bend right over, push it right over, I guess. We might as well stay and talk. Or not. Yeah, we'll stay and talk, we're just here. And let's push that right over now. And when I hit the 70,000 meter mark this time, I'm going to cut engines, and hopefully that works better. I'm using a lot more fuel this time, it must be heavier. Yeah, okay, the spinning stopped, which is good. Alright, down to my last... Oh, no, I still got a lot of fuel left. I'm not overheating anymore, which is good. When I hit that 70,000 meter mark, I'm going to stop. Alright, cut engines. Let's work this out. Hey, wow. I'm way off orbits. Okay. Let's set this maneuver node up. I ought to somehow fix those orbits up. I don't know how I'm going to do that. I might as well try to fix them up now, I reckon. So what's that? 453? Well, I know I only wanted... to about 100,000, wasn't it? That's 60, too far. 149... 118... 98... 103. Okay, and now let's try fix this angle up. Uh, 
Oh dear. No, sir. It's not what I want. No, oh, jeez, this is going to be a pain to fix up. There we go. Alright. So that's done. Let's line this up now. Okay. Alright. And when I line this up, I'll skip ahead to when we need to burn. Oh dear. Come on, this is not easy. I've gotten too much velocity. Alright, so I'm going to line this up and I'll be back when I'm ready to burn. Alright, we are about 30 seconds out from having to burn, so I'm going to speed up time until we hit about 10 seconds. Slow down. Alright, and on the 5 second mark I'm going to go. Alright. Come on. Come on. Uh, it's going actually quite well. Oop, oop. Going off the where I need to burn. And stop. Hey! I'm in orbit. So, what did I get it to? Well, jeez. Need to fix that ASAP. Add maneuver. <laughs> no, don't want it that big. Shit. Nope, not that way, not that way. Oh, nope. <laughs> These green ones. Oh, well. Oh, dear. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Let's get rid of... No, oh, oh, come on. Nope. 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 So what's the orbit now? 142.47. Add maneuver. What are you doing? No. Exit. I want to get rid of this. How can I get rid of that? Oh, because I'm in... There it is. There we go. Add maneuver. No, that's the wrong way. I needed it about a hundred thousand. No, all right, no, forty six hundred and two. That'll do. All right, so I'm gonna line this one up and I'll be back when we've got to burn. All right, we're ten seconds out of burning again. I don't know what the estimated burn time on this one is. It's not telling me, so it must be just a real short burn. Alright, let's go. Come on. There we go. There we go. Stop. What's the... And we'll get rid of the maneuver node. What's that? 99, that's not too bad. And then when I come around here, I'll add the maneuver and bring this other side in. Alright, and when I, I'll come back when I've got this in perfect orbit and as best as in line with this one. So I don't know how long that's going to take me. It could take me a couple of hours, I don't know. So I'll be back when I've got it lined up as best as I can with the, uh, uh, the space station core. And then I'll come back and we'll try docking. Okay, I'm back after, what, maybe about half an hour, an hour. Pretty much lined up as much as I'm happy with. And we are 500 metres away from them. 581 metres. Now, I can't, I can't see it. Don't know where it is, but I'm going to find it. Now... My orbit's slightly too small, and 
or too big and he's going away. One of the two. So now I'm going to try fix that and try catch up to him. I don't know how to do that, so I'm just going to experiment and hope for the best. Alright, let's burn here and see what happens. Something's going to be extending. 110. 115. We'll try to get that 110, 115 good. What's this? 131. No, I'll stop now. I'll stop my burn. And I'll see what happens if I speed up time. He should catch up to me in this bit here. The other... Oh, oh, okay, come on, come on. Oh, God, this is so intense at the moment. I, I haven't done this before. Successfully done it before. Alright, alright. Uh, let's slow down. Oh, there! 87 kilometers away. What? Alright, F5. Quick save. Quick saving. Quick saving. Alright, let's speed up this time a little. Can I. Is there a way to have that out permanently? Alright. Speed up time, speed up time. He's getting closer. Alright. 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 I need to... Okay, hopefully, if we, if we do one more lap, hopefully he'll get closer again. Oh god, you can probably hear the intensity in my voice. Haven't done this before, as I said. I'm going to be learning on the fly here. Alright, let's go back out. Let's slow time down and let's find my mark. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Above me. No. Below me. No. Nope. Where is he? Where? Is he? Where? Come on. There you are. Oh, you're 28 kilometers away. All right, let's save again. Let's save again. 27. All right, let's go around once more, once more. Oh, God. This is where we should start getting closer now. Come on. Oh, is he getting away from me? No! No, don't... No, come on. He's getting away from me, isn't he? Come on. No! No! No, he's not set as my target anymore either. No! Come on. I botched it. Come on. Oh, so that was the closest we got, that 24. I shouldn't have risked it. Should have not risked it. So, let's... Let's burn a little bit. Max it out. Stop. See what happens. Alright, yeah, happy with that. Oh, Alright, let's speed up this time. Let's see what happens this time. Come on. We can do this. Alright, so... Wait. He's getting ahead of me. Alright, so I need to be inside him. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. Alright, stop. Let's see if I can fix that. So here, we'll add a manoeuvre. Wrong way. This is intense. Come on. 52. Too far. That's in the atmosphere. Come on. 
67. Let's go to about 90. 86. 96. I'm happy with 96. Yeah, because that's what a 10k difference. Let's make it a 16 kilometer roughly. Where's these numbers? Periapsis 91. His peri 91. Okay, happy. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna fix this and get as close as possible again, and I'll be back. Okay, we're at 28 kilometers away. Now, I have no idea what I'm doing. No idea. Uh, so, I'm just gonna guess and pick one of the purple things, I think. And try go over there. Yeah, it's, it's this purple thing here. Alright, so I'm not going to absolutely gun it, but I'm going to go. I haven't got much rocket fuel left. I'm going to be annoyed, very annoyed, if this doesn't work. Come on. Let me see that go down. Let me see that go down. Yes, I'm getting closer. Something's happening. Something's happening. Hey, what happened? Alright. No need to burn anymore. No need to burn anymore. Okay, okay. Going way too fast, but let's hope I can do it. I'm speeding up still. How do I change them over? How do I switch to control mode? There. The control mode is changed. Good. Good, good, good. Come on. Come on. I can do this. Oh, no. What's... What's happening? What's happening? Let's... Uh, come on, oh, I need to aim back at this. I'll sl slow down with RCS in a minute. Alright, let's change this to something like 20 metres a second. And then I can just fast forward it until I get closer. Because once I hit around 20, 10 metres a second mark, I'll be happy. Because I'm... I don't want to run out of fuel this close to it, so let's do another quick save. Let's do another quick save. Alright, right. When I hit 15 kilometres away, I'm going to slow down. Oh, jeez, I'm... I'm very nervous. Right. That'll do. Let's slow down a little. Let's slow down a lot. Fast. Uh, oh, that. oh, no! I'm out of fuel! Oh, no. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. And I've got 125 mono propellant left. Oh no, this is very bad. Very, very bad. It hasn't rendered in yet. Alright. Let's speed up time a bit. Uh, cannot warp faster than one time so while ship is throttled up. Okay, let's throttle down. Oh, you're going away, come on. Hopefully in the next pass... Oh, oh, wow. How? Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I think I failed. Uh, using physics warp can affect... Stro oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh. 
So close. Well, I'm going to say... I'm going to call it quits for this episode. It was a good try. I've learnt a lot. Come back next time when hopefully I will get docked. And all good. I've saved it. I've saved the ship design so I'll be able to just load straight up and try again. So don't forget to like, rate, comment, subscribe, uh, follow me on Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash codhope1234. I hope to see you next time, and goodbye.